What's up, homies? This is Jay Cap. Today I'm bringing you another video here. This is just going to be a short vlog on uh, basically UGC Niagara and then going forward after that. So basically, for those of you who didn't know, um, UGC Niagara was this past weekend. I had a good time, but unfortunately we did not play as well as we wanted to. We lost 3-2 to Envy in a really close match. That was actually super close. Um, we lost both Search and Destroys in that match. and. Losing both searches will kill you. If you can't win search and destroy, you're not going to win. And it killed us. Um, you guys may have heard the saying by now, search and destroy wins championships. And it always ends up proving true. So unfortunately, um, we ended up getting ninth through 12th place. Like I said, not nearly as good as we wanted. But, you know, it is, it is what it is. We also lost to TK in the loser's bracket. They came out. They just, they just beat us. We tied uh, Sovereign Dom. And then we replayed it and just lost it. Just flat out lost it. No, like, they, no, like, oh, we choked or anything like that. We just flat out got outplayed, period. So hopefully these are, like, small mistakes we can work on. Because moving on from Niagara, the next big thing here is the X Games. And right now we're, I think, fifth overall in pro points, which is good for us because two of the teams ahead of us are Envy and COL. And they've already qualified. So out of the five spots that are left, because as you may know, the top three teams from Champs all qualify, which is actually not COL, excuse me, EG now. They, um, for those of you who didn't hear about that, COL changed organizations. Net, they're now with EG, so it's the same roster, HTP, Crim6, Karma, but they're now under the name Evil Geniuses, which is a big uh, organization in like other esports games, not so much Call of Duty. They're now getting in Call of Duty, obviously, though. So... Evil Genius is qualified, Opti Gaming qualified, and Envy qualified for champs already. And then there's five more spots based off of pro points. And out of those five spots, we're currently in third place. So that's good, but we're the teams behind us are pretty close to us. So there's still a chance we don't make it. So I'm grinding these uh, S&D tourneys here every day, basically. So look out for those streams, by the way. I'm going to be streaming S&D tourneys basically every day if we don't have league matches because... Every pro point counts, and I want to go to the X Games. Uh, it's like crazy event, so I mean, it should be crazy at least. I don't know for sure, but it's like definitely a big thing here for Call of Duty esports. That's like there's really nothing in the past to compare to it. Like we've had COD champs, but that's not the X Games. It's not the same publicity, same. You know what I mean? It's just a big, big event. We want to go really badly, so we're doing what we can for that, and. I mean, besides that, really, not much to say. Like I said, the S&D tournament is going to be big. The real big tournament here coming up that um, is basically like the last big thing before the pro point, before blah, 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 before the pro points lock for X Games. Last big thing coming up is a 5K tournament this weekend. Unfortunately, it's on Mother's Day, which I think kind of sucks. I know my mom's not happy about it. She was like, she wanted to talk to someone from MLG why the schedule like that. But unfortunately, it's on Mother's Day, so that kind of sucks because it's basically necessary to play unless you're like unless you're guaranteed a spot already you like need to play this 5k because like i said before every pro point counts oh, excuse me every pro point counts though so i'm not leaving anything to chance saying oh well hopefully we make it you know let's just not play you know we're doing everything in our power to make it so that's all i got we got league matches coming up here before that but like i said next big thing is the x games um the 5k this weekend Look out for the daily streams of SD tournaments, or if not SD tournaments, then uh, team scrims or league matches or whatever possible. I just want to play Call of Duty, qualify for the X Games, go to the X Games, and win, hopefully. Hopefully, play a lot better than we did in Niagara. So, that's really all I got to say, guys. Uh, like I said in the start of the video, this is really just a quick update vlog on everything happening right now post Niagara. By the way, quick not side note. After Niagara, I think every event here and out is going to be on the Xbox One, which is good. Not because really I like the Xbox One so much, just because I don't like changing from 360 to the One and then back to 360. And it's just really a hassle. So the fact that we now have a set console, or should have a set console at least for the rest of Ghosts, is good. It's good for everyone. You know, just no more changing back and forth. That gets annoying. So Xbox One from here on out. So. That's that, and everything I said about the X Games. I'm trying to think if I missed anything. I don't think I did. 
So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, as always, this has been JCap. We'll see you later.